The federal government at UNESCO has outlined a three-year running plan by to tackle out-of-school children challenge within the country. Secretary General, National Commission for United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization, Dr. Olagunju Idowo, speaking on Advocate Broadcasting Network flagship program, Morning Express, highlighted the innovative strategies adopted by the ministry to tackle the crisis. He revealed that Bruno Ekiti Kaduna, Kanu, Kastina, KB and Plato states have benefited from first phase of the Adolescence Girl Initiative for Learning and Empowerment Program of the Federal Ministry of Education. There is a three-year ruling plan that Nigeria is already, uh, already working on and uh, the Federal Ministry of Education along with some of the subnationals, some state governments and uh, the development partners they are working it out so that at least 70% of these out-of-school children will be back to school in the next three years. And this will be reviewed every year. That is, there is a monitoring and evaluation system that will be, uh, monitor, that will be monitoring this, evaluating this towards uh, making sure that it is achieved. Speaking further, he also emphasized federal government's commitment to enhancing security in schools. There is this uh, uh, DOTS, the priority area, D O A O T S, that the, the Ministry of Education is championing under this present Minister of Education and in, along with UNESCO. DOTS means that is the, the D, that means data. The O oh, there means out of school, which is a serious issue that we want to tackle. And the teacher, the the T the there is teachers' capacity building, and S there means uh, the skills development. UNESCO is working with the, with the Ministry of Education hand in hand towards making sure that these four priority areas can address this issue of youth skills development and also out of school. Dr. Ido urged continued collaboration with stakeholders to ensure every child has access to free and compulsory universal basic education across the country.